What's going on, Velocity Billions? Swazzy Bill here. Well, I'm to start the video. A boat breaking right before my video. Anyway, what's going on? Swazzy Billions, and uh, I, I thought the volume was fixed. Let me get that for you guys. <laughs> anyway, what's going on, Swazzy Billions? Swazzy Bill here on another island. And uh, I want to say welcome back to a Minecraft with Let's Play. And I'm doing that. That's what I'm doing. Well, I'm going to spend the rest of the day because it's going to be my dog. Yeah. Yeah, um, basically, um, uh, this best was killing me. Well, not actually killing me. You know, it's like getting in my head. So, um, what I did was I explored the rest of the cave on camera. Uh, I found a few pieces of coal, but nothing really that useful. So, I decided to sail off in the boat, which I saw in the boat before, to the jungle. And that's pretty much how I got here in the middle of the ocean. Uh huh. I also found um, off camera a load more sugar cane. So I have over half a stack now. So that's really going to come in handy when I need it. And yeah, I guess we're here. I guess. Let's take a look. Behold! What will hopefully be a prop cave because if it is not, I'm gonna rage so hard. Uh, I really will. Let's take a look. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, this looks nice, but nothing. Um. What's this? No. Um. Path. Okay, this looks promising. Come on. And more coal, which I'm not going to grab because I almost have a stack of that. Okay, finally we're getting somewhere. Yes. Okay. So, yeah, guys, this looks to me like it's a proper cave. And just as I say that, dead end. But there is some higher in here. This is uh, something in Minecraft. Um, that you can actually use to survive out here. You can create like armor and stuff and it requires a stone pickaxe or higher to actually mine. Otherwise, if you try and mine up like a one pickaxe or if you're bare hands, you won't get it. The block will just completely disappear. And by the way, if you're new to Minecraft, please feel free to use my Let's Play series as reference. And if you haven't already, please feel free to subscribe and tell your friends because oh, yes. my, my channel is awesome. I want you to tell your friends about it. So. Yeah, uh, I got that. Uh, I'm just gonna grab this bit of coal. Man, there's a lot here. Alright, so, I'll come back for this if I ever, like, run low on coal and I need to smell iron or something. But for now, I'm gonna head back up. Uh, I'm gonna get back my to all my torches. Should I? Yeah, I, I will. Took me five seconds of thinking, but I'm taking back my torches. Because I'm gonna use as many of them as I can get. Plus, I don't want to accidentally craft too many and they like take up my whole inventory. So, yeah. I'm just gonna grab these. Grab the these. I think it just came with me. Oh, is this? Oh, nothing. Should I torch them before? I thought that was loud or something. Alright. Uh. And, uh, if you didn't see my last episode, um, I actually have tons of experience with Minecraft, so that's how I, I know so much about caves and stuff. If you're wondering, how does this guy know so much about caves? Well, I know how I really know so much about caves. Speaking of caves, this one looks promising. Alright, let's take a look. Um, definitely gonna think about going down there. Alright, I hear running water. That could just be the surface, because, you know, I, I spawned by notion, but, again, this cave looks promising. So, yeah, I just passed by some iron. I'm going to get that in a minute. Would you look at that? Bam. Parkour. Parkour, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, yeah, um, I'm just going to mine some stuff later. I just want to make sure that this cave goes somewhere. Alright, so, dead end, but I got a stone pick. I can mine this a bit and keep exploring it. So, yeah, um, I'm kind of almost low on torches, so I'm just going to mine up some of this iron. And again, um, 
what you can also do with it is you can um, build roller coasters and stuff with iron. If you can make like rails and minecarts. So um, once I have enough material, I can probably just like um, make a huge roller coaster by my house and, and start the episode off of that on top on that just going around it. So that should be fun. Yeah. But now we gotta mine this iron like a mouse. Oh. Parkour. Alright, um, and, um, also one more thing I have to mention, um, if, uh, you like what you see, don't only feel free to subscribe, but also feel free to get the game for yourself, just give it a try, because, um, yeah, in this game, as I said in my last episode, the possibilities are endless, Minecraft oh, yeah. is a total party thing, so, yeah, uh, let's get back to mine. See what other things I come across. Let's see, iron. 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 Iron into my mouth. Uh -oh. Furnace. Plagues. These plagues. <laughs> oh, well, I'm not picking that up. There we go. So. Yeah, enough of that, um... Is that where I just came from? Hello! Hello! Uh, I'm sorry, I had to... <laughs> Alright, so, yeah. Um, got that. There's that water again. Um, this is where I came from. Found a bunch of coal here. Alright, you know what? I I'm so tempted, I'm just gonna go down here. I don't even care if I get hurt. Um... Bam. Again, I have it on peaceful, so I should be regenerating quick. So, yeah, I didn't realize it would take me back here, but might as well keep exploring, right? So, yeah, let me see what I got here. All right, I could probably craft myself a few more torches, so uh, I'm just going to do that. There we go. 16 should do it for now. Now, light my way. Hey, who turned on the lights? Probably back here again. I've got a whole cave network connecting to back to the same place. And it's pretty cool. Uh, caves rarely ever turn out like this. And caves rarely ever um, go somewhere. But yeah, I looked off camera and it wasn't a proper cave anyway. It, it, if you fast forward through the intro, you, 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 don't, you won't know what I'm talking about. And who turned out the lights? Come on, let's get a little torch down here. Alright, um, a little torsion of the sound I meant to say. Anyway, yeah, more iron. So, let me see here. Um, how much do I have? Ooh, 20. That's almost enough for my goal. Now, guys, um, you can actually make armor in this too, uh, um, with, uh, iron and stuff. So let me guys just show you this real quick. So, yeah, we got, like, helmets, we got chest plates, got pants, got boots. And, um, the better the material, um, then the more likely it is to be protective and the more likely it'll last for, like, leather. It'll probably last you about five minutes in a mob battle. Uh, iron probably lasts a little longer than leather. Gold, not really much durability in pretty much anything, so it'll probably go really quick. But diamond, diamonds are not, I'm not talking about diamonds like you, you sell in jewelry stores, diamonds that you can craft into really OP armor as well as weapons and tools. So, yeah, one day that's really going to come in handy. So let me just pick this up real quick. And, um, so, uh, in all, all in all, I need exactly 24 iron ore to make the full set of iron armor. And, um, I could probably grab a little more for, like, iron tools and stuff. Maybe um, an axe. Uh, in the game, it helped me cut down trees faster, much like in real life. That's why lumberjacks have them in real life, if you guys didn't know that. Logic! <laughs> Alright, so, yeah, I can also make myself a sword, which will do a little more damage than this one. Like, if you look here, uh, the better the tool material that you use to make a sword, then the more damage will do. Like, this one will do four. A stone sword will do five, but I decided to make that. An iron sword, I think, will do about six. I, I don't know. But I'm not going to worry about explaining this to you for now. But for now, I'm just going to mine up all this iron. 
Uh, I already got a bunch of wood last episode, so I should be able to craft stuff easily. And more iron. I'm going to have an iron surplus by the end of the episode. I mean, seriously, this is a lot of iron. I don't know if I've ever found this much iron before in my past Minecraft experiences, but I remember once I found over three stacks of it in about an hour, which, if you think about it, is a lot of time and a lot of iron. You know, if you put a little logic into it. Just put a little logic in it and make it drop. Oh my god. I'm down at lava level? Oh my god. Well, uh, uh, I am quite shocked. So, yeah, guys, this stuff right here, this stuff is really hard to come by. And even harder to use in the game. This here is redstone dust. This is the fuel of the the engineering and the redstone part of Minecraft. I can use it for the roller coaster and stuff. So I'm definitely gonna come back for that. But right now we gotta keep away from the lava and from the squire because I'm not if I'm not careful it'll it'll flow me into the lava and I don't want to die. But then again I keep inventory on so I shouldn't have to worry about losing anything. I don't have to worry about being completely lost and having no idea. Um, where I went because if you remember I didn't spawn on this island. I sailed over it after I went to a bunch of islands. So If you don't know what I'm talking about just you know w watch the first episode I mean, why, why don't you guys want to watch the first episode? You you'd be all caught up. All right, so yeah um, I guess I'll go back to that little bit of iron, but before I do how much do I have right now? 37, so that's enough for the armor and stuff, plus a little left over, but I'm going to collect this anyway, because you never know how much iron you'll need for a Let's Play series. Uh, considering that Sampy's has gone on for, like, almost 400 episodes by now, um, I have to say I'm going to need a lot of iron, but I can collect it over time. I'm just not going to spend, like, the first 100 episodes mining up iron and trying to avoid lava and stuff, because... That, that would be too boring for you guys. So, I'll probably spend one episode in the caves, maybe head back up to the surface, and at least get it smelting before I end the episode. But I'd be careful, because uh, I do have a time limit. Because, oh! Oh my god, I was so close to dying. I, I better just block some of this off. That'll do. Alright, so... But yeah, that was so close. I... I this is why water can be a pest in Minecraft. I'm sure it's nice with swimming in, but you can drown it, much like in real life. It can send you someplace you don't want to be in real life. It's like a huge waterfall and you can't fight the current. Uh, water can be dangerous, but it can also be a good source for, for health. So, drink plenty of water, kids. <laughs> Alright, and I have no idea where this commentary is going anymore. Now this stuff is what we have to watch out for, gravel. This stuff can be very pesky when you're mining or when people are trolling you fit in multiplayer mode for this game. But, um, hang on, give me a little, let me get a little light so you can actually see what it looks like. So, yeah, uh, gravel, um, it can be very pesky. It's one of those blocks that kind of fall on you, but if you break it enough times, you can get a very useful material for it that is extremely hard to come by and you can use for crafting and this material is actually vital for visiting other dimensions, like I talked about in my last episode. So, you know, I'm just going to take a few gravel blocks with me and carry them around for now. Oh, I got the material already. So, yeah, this here is flint. You can actually use it for flint and steel, which you need to light a portal to one of the other dimensions. But I'll get to that once I actually make it that far. But for now, <clears throat> just got to try and avoid this lava of me get to that redstone, because I really want that redstone. It, it, it's calling my name. I'm so tempted to jump in the lava after it and risk everything, but I won't, because that's not the kind of person that I am. Alright, so, yeah. Uh, I've got the redstone surrounded, but before I can actually mine it, I need to grab myself a better pickaxe. Otherwise, uh, if I use my stone pickaxe with the little dirt blade it has, and it'll, it'll probably just you know, fail, because I'll lose it all, and you never know when you will you might run into more redstone, so yeah, I'm just gonna get that iron smelting, and, um, while that is smelting, um, just, uh, feel free to comment down below some stuff, um, stuff about, like, uh, what you think of my series so far, um, also be sure to comment down below, um, 
you know, if you uh, spot in the iron or something here that I might miss. If I, if I did miss anything, feel free to comment down below. And again, if you haven't already, please feel free to subscribe and tell your friends. Because, uh, again, why would you want to tell your friends about my channel? My, my channel might be kind of new to the life of a YouTuber, but hey, uh, it, it is pretty good so far. Uh, I do have to say. Oh, what am I doing? I need the iron. God. So yeah, I'm going to leave the rest of that smelting. Crap myself a better pick. Oh, wrong one. And bam. Now, redstone ore usually gives you five or four or six pieces of redstone dust at a time. So if I come by a lot, then that should be good. So, yeah. For now, I'm just going to uh, leave that to smelt. Hopefully, I can find my way back to it. And, yeah, I'm pretty much gonna, just going to try and go across this lava, see if I can find any more redstone. Or maybe even some more useful things other than that. Maybe, uh, um, I don't know. A dungeon of some kind, a, a mine shaft, which I will get to if I actually come across one in the series. So, yeah, I'm just gonna build my way over. Building my way, building my way over. Building my way, building my way over. Okay, um, so, yeah, no distractions, Swazi. Come on, you gotta be really careful. And good thing I turned around because I wouldn't want to walk straight in the gravel and be like, what? But why am I stopping? Bam, I die. And I'd be lost. Because gravel can be very pesky, but at the same time, quite useful. But at the same time, quite pesky. Oh. That, wait, that actually kind of helped me a bit. Because now, now I have a block. Bam. Alright. So, yeah. I'm literally, like, one block away from a flamey and, 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 and melting death. So, I've got to be very careful. That's why I'm crouching. If you don't know, uh, you can crouch in Minecraft. You see this? That that's crouching right there. So yeah, um, that basically uh, makes you a little more careful. It can help you sneak a bit. Plus, if you're in multiplayer mode or something, then uh, it can actually hide your gamer tag so people can't see and you kind of troll them or kill them or something. I think that works on mobs too, but I guess we won't find out until I actually get up to where I switch to difficulty later in the series, which might be kind of soon because I'm making a lot of progress. First, it was the first step to look at me for a cave, and now I have almost a stack of iron over there smelting away. So, yeah, um, I'm making a lot of progress so far, and bam, dirt block. Dirt solves every problem. Uh, there's uh, something you gotta do, but there's nothing uh, protecting you. Just get dirt, because dirt is the next. Um, Diamond. No, I, I'm kidding. Dirt can never be as valuable as diamonds. I mean, we see literally see dirt everywhere. And I saw some iron behind me. Don't worry, I didn't miss it. I'm going to come back for it in a bit. Right now, I've got to get this hard part out of the way. Because if I screw up or run out of blocks, that's going to be an issue for when I'm trying to get back. So, yeah, just let me mind this. Um, okay, good thing I, I, I shifted. I, I, I shift clipped. Shift clicked. Yeah. So yeah, um, I see a little more redstone. Uh, I'm just gonna get that, and I might actually have to explore this cave in the next episode too, because I mean, with lava and ooh, yeah, I'm definitely gonna get that before I end the episode. Um, now that guy's over there. That is Lapis Lazuli. It can be used for dyeing, it can be used for decoration, but most importantly, I'm going to need it to enchant my armor. That It can be enchanted with stuff to like make the sap boost go up, uh, stuff to keep you from dying as quickly with the armor on. So yeah, Lapis is going to really come in handy in the series as well. But for now, I'm just going to worry about all of this beautiful redstone. Uh, I, I know. But <laughs> anyway, um... Yeah, it looks like the lava keeps flowing over here with a little more redstone in it. So, I'm just going to block this off real quick for now. Place a torch above it and get this um, redstone dust. Because uh, if, uh, if I didn't show you, if you don't, I didn't see the last episode, lava can actually burn anything it touches. So, if I um, were to... Let me see. Do I have anything I can dispose easily? Yeah, I've got this. So... If I were to drop uh, a piece of sandstone or something, like anything in general, into the lava, bam, it's gone. You're never going to get it back. So if you're playing Minecraft, be careful not to do that. Otherwise, you'll regret it for the rest of your Minecraft life. 
Anyway, um, yeah, I'm just gonna get at least one of these lapis ores and then end the episode because I am almost out of time. Um, man, I need more blocks. Should I risk it with the gravel? I, I might do it. Well, that didn't work. Um, so, yeah, you guys, uh, I'll probably get it in the next episode, but... Hang on. Do you reckon I can... Oh! Okay, good thing I'm crouching right now. Uh, so, yeah, I'm just going to place this under me, so... Um, yeah, I, I am still alive because I crouched. I'm Crouch Man. Crouch Man. So, yeah, I'm probably just gonna end here and get the rest of this off camera. Find my way out alive so you guys don't have to see me die if it, it does come to that. Anyway, um, I hope you guys did enjoy this episode, even if we spent most of it. Oh my god, there's more. I'm gonna have to get that off camera too. Anyway, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you haven't already, please feel free to subscribe. And tell your friends because, uh, well, again, why don't you want to tell your friends about my channel? And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please stick around. And again, feel free to use my Minecraft. And yeah, um, I, I hope you guys enjoyed. And see you later. Bye.